Am I not supposed to have four scrolls in the looting bag then? Because uh, like one item was missing and uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah. Oh my god. Mathematically calculated. Holy cow, bro. 72.9 mil in the looting bag. If you've been on Reddit, you've probably seen a bunch of memes of the new teleport anchor scroll. People found out that the new zombies that they added, the drop rate from them is 1 in 20,000. And it is in wilderness. It's in fact like the biggest hotspot right now with people PK. Even those like level 16 wilderness or something is very low, but you get teleport blocked. Well, because of this, they actually changed it, which... At first I thought it was a joke, but you had to go to the old news post, which was posted on 10th of April, but there was an update on Friday, April 12th. So the drop rate for teleport anchoring scroll from the zombie locker specifically, so it's not from zombies, I believe from zombies it may, it may be still 1 in 20k, but if you're using keys, it's going to be 1 in 275, but you will no longer get double loot, because you're supposed to get uh, double pirate loot whenever you use a key, but it's not going to be working on scroll specifically. The rest of the loot will be doubled though. So it must be common, right? The scroll must not be like 50 mil, whatever it was at the time. So I was going to try to buy it for a medium price, which is 16 mil, and it should sell, and it did. And it actually sells for 12.3 million. So 12 mil slash 275, which is the drop rate. If the keys are going for 43,000 each, you can actually make profit because I'm only looking at the scroll drop rate, but you also get the regular loot, which probably adds up also. So maybe I can buy a bunch of them for 50k each. No, because that would be easy profit. So the teleport anchoring scroll says that a formidable magic spell which prevents unwanted teleportation. So maybe this is going to work for other activities in the future, but currently it got a uh, couple uses, which actually I'm going to read this. This is probably the longest confirmation screen that I see is become immune to the abyssal demon and elder chaos druid teleportation attacks. Look how quickly these are selling because this activity is so popular. Every single world is packed with so many people. So they get like a couple keys, four or five keys. Well, it turns out there's a limit of 250 keys that I can buy. But the good thing is I have some alt accounts. The chest is located in very low wilderness in this broken ship. It's like a new thing that they added. So I'm going to use the lumberyard teleport because there's no way I'm teleporting to the wilderness immediately and i think what i remember when i opened just like 10 keys or something i, I think you need to have like amulet of avarice to get the noted items because otherwise if you get like battle staffs even the looting bad will you know fill up so maybe i can open all 250 at once but that also means i'm sculled so yes i'm risking maybe quite a bit uh, maybe that's the disc that they wanted to add. There's this guy near the ship, you can check the zombie pilot, it says, can you tell if I use teleport anchoring scroll, which I did. Uh, yeah, I can tell by the cut of a jib that you've read the anchoring scroll, but why does he say that? I thought there's gonna be like a disable option or something. I don't know, for some reason you wanna enable. It just checks. Um, okay, so these are the lockers that you have to open, so you gotta be very careful because somebody can uh, log in below me, so like immediately spec me or something. Just don't know how popular it is, and does it broadcast to everybody it doesn't seem to be the case because where would that be broadcasted like upstairs maybe it does have a counter also I opened this chest 15 times right now and i still did not check if everything is noted yes it is so you have to come in here skull collection log slot oh, no completed. way holy cow teleport anchor scrolls 16 mil okay it's 12 mil <clears throat> I'm not leaving, right? We're not leaving. We're going for another one, but we're going to close the chat since it's not going to pop out the collection lock slot anymore. That means, you don't know, maybe it's going to be three scrolls at the end of the trip. My bad, I cheated a little bit. I looked at the clan chat, but I saw that I got two Laranski, so this confirms that I get like double the loot that I would get from zombies. Weirdly, they drop Laranskis off task, so maybe that's an oversight or maybe it's not, but because of that, Laranskis have crashed quite a bit because I opened 10,000 like five days ago. They were 146k, now they're 131k. I can't really see in here, but I spent exactly 15 million on 250 keys and I got back 21.7 mil but is it actually gonna be in cash because the scroll says 16 mil so is it actually so let's see if you actually did not get the scroll yeah and you just get the regular loot you spend 15 mil and you got only 5 mil back that is minus 10 mil because you did not get the scroll but this is pretty much the drop rate statistically every 250 keys or every 275 keys you should get one okay just use my alt account to buy another 250 keys let's go did i get any anchor scrolls not this time not a single around keys also the total loot is very consistently five mil once again and as i put the price half a million cheaper it sold in 39 seconds for 11 mil that looks like almost exactly 10 minutes it takes to open 250 keys so this can be done extremely quick but how do you bypass the limit 
you better have some friends. Maybe I should ask around people. Let's see if there is a single telephone scroll in the loading map because otherwise it's going to be minus 10 mil again and there is not. It is 5.6 mil. Okay, trip number four, please. At least one single. Oh my god, I got three. Oh my god, this looks so weird. 55 mil in the in the loading bag. Oh my, wait, wait, wait. I have to see the, the clan. <laughs> Grads, keys paying off. This guy, by the way, bought me the keys. I sold a couple of them for 11 mil. The other one is not selling for like 14 minutes right now. I think I'm gonna start doing 500 at once because I feel very safe. I don't think anyone's gonna come. Famous last words. 500 keys open later. A boom. Two anchoring scrolls. 60 mil. I was scrolling here a little bit just to see people's reactions. And I see I've got almost back to back. I think like Mao and then another one. Question mark. So many keys. Lol. Luck is unreal, but it's not unreal. I'm literally on the drop rate. I got three scrolls, not two scrolls. How did I miss the, the other one? No wonder it was 60 mil. And the looting back looks very consistently. If I did not get any scrolls, it would be 5 mil per 250 keys, approximately. Insta sold these because they were just not selling. Just I had to sell them for like 9 mil each. I still made nice profit because I sold, sold them for 26.6 mil, which is pretty much this is what I spent on the keys. So that means all everything else that I got in the looting bag, so almost 11 mil, that was pure profit from 20 minutes of opening 500 keys. And that's the first guy actually, that's the first guy in how many chests? That is 1,600. A pure, but I'm gonna log off because, you know, he could bring his main account. Another 500 keys, another bag to check. But last time the bag was full, so that means if this time it was full, and if I got a single scroll in my inventory, I would have gotten like four of them in the bag, so it didn't. So that means it's not above three. So let's check the bag, and it is actually three. So it's not above three, but it's three exactly. And we made profit once again. And again, I got a scroll. Is that scroll, how does it work? Do you charge it? And then I got another one. And I think they're like they're looking at the price and they think like oh it's 16 mil but it's actually like 8 point something mil without the scrolls the looting bag is worth 11 mil this morning we started at 3000 chests hello he says and yeah you think i'm gonna chat this guy looks very scary he couldn't attack me but goddamn <laughs> <laughs> Hello, bye. This is the second time though I see somebody log in and what I have like 3,000 plus chests right now. Yeah, 3.6 thousand chests, second guy logged in only. But this time there's a couple teleport anchoring scrolls. So wait, I could have hit four of them this time, but I guess maybe I didn't get some sort of item. Let me back these scrolls and the total loot should be slightly above 10 mil, maybe even 11 on a good day. 10.5 mil, it's always like this. Every 500 keys are getting 10.5 mil on average. Well, I guess it happened for the very first time. I got to know an item in inventory. However, it was a dragon longsword. Must be some sort of rare drop, I guess. Maybe that was the item that was missing last time. So what I'm thinking is that there's definitely three scrolls inside the bag. Am I not supposed to have four scrolls in the looting bag then? Because uh, like one item was missing and uh, one, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah. Oh my God. Mathematically calculated. Holy cow, bro. 72.9 mil in the looting bag. I want to see the client teleport anchor and scroll teleport anchor and grads lol grads smitherman then laran's laran just who is laran there's teleport anchor and scroll grads dove this dove guy single-handedly crashing the market no i just came with 467 keys i was chanting a little bit with the clan chat and i see another one no way but I, as I, I i was just talking bro in two like what 34 keys i got a couple scrolls oh my god bro oh my god so lucky because i put in the long sword so that means this is the fourth scroll jesus christ there's 250 keys left to go also since i added the long sword should be three scrolls in the bag yes and one scroll in here so did i get eight scrolls and a thousand keys also we got now over five thousand chests open well i call this junk loot but it's not junk loot this is from 1000 keys 21 mil so again on average every 500 keys is approximately 10.5 mil and is it actually eight yes i got eight scrolls in uh, in a thousand and again i checked the clan chat a little bit just to see how far away they were they were very close you leave your character afk in the grand exchange just for five minutes and then you see this listen guys i made enough money from these pirate chests i can upgrade my boulevard to a much better looking one yeah now when pkr see me they will extra want to kill me they will extra not give up and chase me all the way to level one wildy but it looks much fancier so a thousand keys cost me 45 million and just from scrolls in a thousand keys i made 61 mil and then there's also 21 mil in the looting bag so that is 82 million and according to my calculations 82 minus 45 that is 37 million 
profit. But it is the luckiest chest that I got. Luckiest thousand in five thousand chests. You know there's gonna be a time where I get only one scroll. So you have like a dedicated tab to my loot. Not everything goes here, but like most of the stuff. But then I go to Buildy tab and I see that I got fourteen thousand blighted anglerfish, and it's just crashing constantly. I actually bought a thousand on the very first day when this Buildy was updated, and they were like one k each. So now they're like 700. It's like the best healing food and it's 700k each. And then 10,000 blighted Monterey because I don't actually use them and I know that I'll get one. The reason why I'm doing this now because I don't want to, you know, I don't want them to crash even more because I'm only at 4,000 zombie kills right now. Monterey is like below 600 also. 5.8 mil for 10,000. Is that 7 million in blighted ancient sacks? Oh, who is this guy? Who kept a petty... 78, what is he doing? He's not even, what? He's, a, he's literally a scout. He's, you, you're hopping. Okay, let's continue. The current count of the chest is over 5,000. All right, seems that in the evening it's a little bit more active because I had to escape this guy who teleport blocked me and then he splashed a lot. So I got lucky. But I realized that I really needed to bring more anglerfish because of the KO potential. Another 500 at 5.5k now in total. There is a couple... Teleport scrolls. <laughs> oh, what the hell? This guy comes in. The Mao second scroll. Did he actually? Is there? Yeah, there's no broadcasting. Would have been fun. And he just runs back immediately. And like, I don't know, the past maybe 500 keys, I got logged in like four or five times by like max players. Approximately 140 mil worth of zombie pirate keys. I am not going to be opening all of them at once. Of course, 500 is the maximum. Even though, yes, I could do like a thousand, but those PKs yesterday, yeah, we're not doing that. So I drank some stamina potions in the bank because I don't have a stamina pot in here. And the very first chest that I opened was teleport anchoring scroll because i saw this in the clan i was like wait is that the last one why is it like so at the very bottom and then i opened the looting bag it is the very first item that came to the looting bag guys we're getting closer over 9,000 chests have been opened so far okay all the keys have been used at 3,200 whatever i had i'm just curious if i'm gonna make any money because i don't think that i got enough scrolls this trip got three which is like the maximum so i had a trip which had zero scrolls imagine checking the bag nothing inside then another trip had one scroll and this is 500 keys by the way you're supposed to get two scrolls per and then the third trip i got nothing again so in 1500 keys i got one single scroll so i got 10 scrolls exactly in 3200 well just before i sell it you can look at the loot from 3200 keys it's like 280 battle axe of 6 mil. These are the highest value, by the way. Rune Warhammers at the top of the list always when you look at the total loot from Zombie specifically because these chests were not tracked, unfortunately. 2.5 mil in Rune Med Helms. Okay. So yeah, the scrolls went down to 7 mil. Let me grab this 98 mil. So those 3,000 plus keys that I bought for 135 mil, I sold all the loot for 146 million. So that was plus 11 million profit. And statistically, I was supposed to profit even more because i was supposed to get 13 scrolls instead of 10 this could have been additional 20 mil and i'm not just saying like oh could have been but i'm just saying that oh my god these keys are like insane money it took me a couple hours to open those 3600 keys so yes it's not just buying them but you also have to use them that was already like 5 mil an hour by just opening the keys and not getting the additional three scrolls that i should have gotten otherwise this would have been isn't this like legit 10 mil an hour currently? On my main account, on, on my other account, I like instantly bought them. So at any moment, this could be like, yep, there we go. Oh my God. They're so cheap, bro. Like 10,000 chests. The number looks so good. 10,000 zombie party keys, 38 teleport anchoring scrolls. Sold at various prices, so... How can I even do the price check of this whole thing? And sadly, because this was new content, Runelight was not tracking anything. But I tracked it myself, and it shows that the first 5,000 chests got me 61 mil profit. But that's mainly because of those 8 scrolls that I got in 1,000 keys. Because the next 1,000 keys did not look good because I got one scroll only. So in the end, I got in total 95 mil profit profit i would say unsurprisingly since this is like wilderness content and i love opening chess i very much enjoy this content but